My friend has the information at the DMV. Go pick it up. Pronto. Well, thank you. Thank you, my violent associate. Empty. I am the victim of chicanery most vile. That's it, Apu. Make them like it. And with that out of the way, welcome back to The Simpsons Hit and Run on the PC. I am your host, Attack Slug. That last mission took me a couple of tries to get through. Sir, this folder is empty. To rob me is one thing, but I never expected you to lie. Dude, relax, okay? I've got the info you need. I just need help with a little more community service. <laughs> oh, I'm totally evil. I should know better than to trust that demented chuckle. But okay. But okay, why not? Quick cash. Help Snake with his community service. Destroy the armored car and avoid Chief Wiggum. And so now I'm driving as Snake here and doing the thing. Going to destroy the thing. Hopefully not as, on as strict of a timer as that last one with a very strict timer. So we'll see what there is on this freaking Matlock Expressway. Is the bane of my existence in this game right now. It is really long and really annoying. We're still here playing The Simpsons Hit and Run, baby. Still enjoying it, even with the minor annoyances. Uh, and have not resorted to cheating yet. I have the option. I have not done it just yet. I'm still playing this 100% legit for you guys here. Really, Quimby? Really? Oh, no. That was a ridiculous wreck. Hey, there's Wiggum. Escape. Chief Wiggum, I mean, we're on a freaking expressway. How am I going to escape when... Bro. 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 I must escape the good chief and his Wigguming. Nah, son. We're getting out of here. We rolling, we riding, we rocking. We doing it. Am I far enough away yet? Nope, not quite. Come on, I had that thing at a flat... Empty. It was empty. All right. No more timer. Drive to the Googleplex. They. I need that thing right there. I need that. Give me the bone. Give me the wrench. Let's do it. All right. Now then. Back to wherever it is. I had to go. I honestly, like, how far am I? I don't know. It could be miles and miles and miles. Oh no, destroy the armored car! And obviously being in this snake car and not saying like a Mr. Plow makes that all the more... All the more... This thing's armored, man. What am I supposed to do here? It's heavily armored vehicle destruction. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Come back. Hey, look Look at what we don't have. We don't have a uh, timer here. And that is most enjoyable. But at the same time... Can I get through this destruction and have Snake's car live through it, is the question here. Because if I can't, that's a problem. If I start smoking and can't find a yellow wrench like that, this is going to be an issue. He's only at half. I need that right up there in the sky. I can't get it from here. So I will continue cautiously following because there is no timer and waiting for the opportunity to get a wrench, because if I explode, guess what? I gotta do it again, and I don't want that. Show me the wrench. Show me the wrench. There's one. Right there. Now then, let us resume our destruction. Let us resume our smashy smashy, because now we can get the job done. Or at least I assume we can get the job done. I hope we can get the job done. With no timer, it makes it that much simpler to deal with this. Oh, oh. Nonsense. And it is nonsense. Don't, don't get me wrong. Armored vehicles, and I'm in just a regular car, is, let's say, a problem. Now he is smoking. Now it is you who are smoking! We're just going in circles. It is... What it is. Like, no! We're both smoking now, so... 
really. Doing this whole loop again because I don't want to lose and I'm already in pretty terrible condition and I hope that that wrench respawns. Otherwise, we in trouble. Yup, wrench right there. I seen it. Now we're good. Now we're good. Now get out of the way, Quimby! Let's end this? Oh, jeez, man. This is ridiculous. Why make me fight an armored truck when I'm in, like, a Cadillac? Like, why would you do that to me? Just explode already! What the hell? There! Now, on to Snake's hideout. Wherever that may be. And I'm smoking again. So, for the third time in this singular mission, I am smoking. Okay, Snake, where is your hideout? I don't want to hit anything before then and accidentally, like, lose at this point in the mission. Like, that would be disastrous. Absolutely disastrous. So, just be very careful of these stupid Quimby vans. Ugh. Alright, I spy with my little eye. There we go. Okay, now we can get back to driving usually how we drive, which is a little bit reckless because, you know, it's hit and run. If you wheel, where is Snake's hideout? Desperately seeking of a hideout. Is it in Moe's Tavern? Nah, can't be, right? Is it back at the DMV? Um, I see Wiggum! Lose the... Really? This is a long mission. This is an exceedingly long mission of a number of variables, and I, I would imagine if you fail any of them, that's kind of a problem. Hey, Chief. No. 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 I'm getting out of here. I am getting out of here. Leave me alone, Wiggum! Oh, come on, I had that. It was at zero, and now it's rapidly increasing. So that's... A conundrum, to be sure. A conundrum, to be sure. Nope. Sorry, Wiggum. We outcha. We outcha. Oh my god, if I, if I fail this now, don't you... Oh. Please tell me I'm not going back to the very beginning. Please tell me I am not... Oh my god! In a world before checkpoints... You send me on a 10 minute mission and fail me at the very end. Oh my god. Later. Okay, back to Snake's hideout. That took, again, way too long. And I know we're gonna end up running into Clancy. So if I can't escape him in the time again, I'll have to do it a third time. And I really don't want to do it a third time. If at all possible. Get out of my way. Good god. Alright, there's Chief Wiggum. Ah, oh, lose the... I got 40... Two seconds to get out of here. Don't hit him. He's on my tail. Don't hit a thing. Oh my god! I'm gonna have to do this whole mission again because of stupid video game reasons. Oh my god. Oh my god. 18. 17. Oh no. No, no, no. All of my... I hate this. I absolutely 2000% hate every single second of what I am doing right now and having to do that whole 10 chunk of minutes a third time. Oh my god. Later that same evening. Okay, how can I possibly mess this up a third time? Let's find out. Because there is the chief, the chief, and we again have 40 seconds to escape the Wiggum. And I have a terrible go, 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 my god. Why was it so easy the third time? I'll never know. But I need to get to this mission and have it finish. By God, it needs to finish. Because it's been so, so exhausting today. Oh my if God. If you do not tell me who owns the cola trucks, then I will be forced to use profanity. Okay, okay, don't go nuts. Look, the cola trucks are registered to the museum. The museum? What? 
Each level of this adventure is more exciting than the last. Well, thank you. Come again. Oh boy, that was certainly something. Talk to Bart. Hey Bart, dude, you just happen to be right here in front of where I need to be? Okay, cool. Oh, Mr. Bart, I have discovered that the evil cola is being made in the Springfield Museum. But that closes in five minutes. And my car is out of gas. Just fill it up at the Quickie Mart. At those prices? No way. Fine, we'll take my car. And that puts me in the honor roller as a curious curator. Head to the amuse- wait, this is your car, Bart? This isn't the honor roller. Whose car is this? This isn't your car, Bart. I don't believe you. Anyhow, we got 22 on this one. At least it's a short, hopefully, thing to finish up this bit of beadness. Uh, or Quimby's gonna just screw me again. What a surprise, what a shock. Just go, 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 go. Make the jump! That's not where I needed to be. It's over here. Okay, wait, what? I need the key, so I get rid of the car. Oh, hey, get, get back here, curator. Get back here! At least it's not an armored truck. That's all I gotta say, is at least it's not an armored truck. Because that was a exercise in frustration. But man, I really don't like this Matlock... Wrong button. This Matlock Expressway. Hit a thing! Hit a pillar! There we go. That's like half your health, bro. There we go. Alright, this is a little bit easier than a freaking armored truck. I'll give it that much. I'll smash you up. Good! Mr. Museum Man, I'll smash... Come on, fishtail! Out of the way! Don't lose... Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I'm hitting things. It's going bad. This is all going wrong. I'm about to get a hit and run, so... Need to be careful? Yeah, I'm really not good at being careful, so... There is that. Okay, buddy, look. I need that key you have. I need that key. He's gonna do the jump, isn't he? I need the key you have. We're both doing this jump! I almost landed on him. It's been awesome. But no, now we're just doing a sick donut for no reason. That's fine. Come on, bro. Wait, the timer? Oh no. 45 on the clock. I need to finish this. Quickly, but he's just so crafty, man. He's just so incredibly crafty, and I want him to smash. Super. Sm Gotta stop doing that. Get back here. How dare you? How dare you with 15 seconds on the clock, and you're just about... Oh, how many... There. Item dropped. Give me the key and now you give me 38 seconds to get back there? Are you this timer stuff is ridiculous today. Absolutely ludicrous because they don't give me enough, enough time to get anything done. It's crazy. 20 through here. Don't you hit me. Get out of the way. 15. I don't want to do this again. Hit and run. That's not what I want to happen! Nine, eight, seven, six, five... It's right there! Oh my god, mission complete. Yes! And a cutscene! I never thought I'd say this, but I'm actually excited to be going to a museum. Shiva H. Vishnu! The cola is dripping from that meteor! Cool, free deadly cola. Oh no! It's a dinosaur. Where's the raptor? Oh, oh! I unplugged it. We did it! We destroyed a priceless archaeological artifact! Oh. What we? I did all the driving! Now let's find out who's behind all this strange cola business. I know it's a cliché, but... Hi, caramba! Kodos, look at these space ratings for foolish Earthlings. 
What happened, Kang? Foolish Earthlings used to be the number one reality show in the galaxy. Space viewers couldn't get enough of these humans and their behavior. Our show is down in all key demos. But our show concept was so perfect. We film these idiotic bipeds with hidden cameras and beam it into every television in the oh, galaxy. Come on, you muckers! These aliens have been secretly filming an intergalactic reality show in Springfield. I knew there was a simple explanation. I'm going to introduce the evil cola into the water supply. People will go mad. I like it. Then we distribute laser guns at the Squidport tourist area. I like it. The cola maddened humans will go berserk. I like it. Destroying themselves and their town. Delivering big, big space ratings for foolish earthlings. <laughs> <laughs> We've got to prevent the aliens from putting laser guns in the hands of cola-drunk townspeople. <laughs> Why? That sounds hilarious. I'd watch that show. I tell you what, you're a bad little boy. <laughs> All right, then. Level complete. 7 to 7 story. 101 bonus. Oh, 15 to 20 cameras for the stupid wasps. Good times. Krusty at Squidport today for a collaboration. And back to being Bart in this video game. My name is Atu. All right, Apu, what you got? Apu, you've got to help me warn Krusty about this alien plot and thus save the good people of Springfield. I'm sorry, sir, but I cannot speak English. I only speak Hindi. But you're speaking English now. Uh, yes, I learned these words phonetically. Well, you're just scared of being vaporized by the space monsters. Up, down, up, down, uh, go hot dog, butter my undershirt, blah, blah, blah. Ah, uh, talk to Otto Man. Hold on, first of all, I don't know when or what or how I'm going to need coins. I'm going to assume I'm going to need coins. So, let me get them out of the way first. Because you know it's going to happen. Otto! Otto Man, I need a ride! No can do, little dude. I gotta round up these other little dudes and get them to Krusty Lou for the studio tour. That's where I need to go. Step on it, Otto! Okay! Right after I drop these kids off at Krusty Lou. Otto. I just said that. All right! Stop hassling me, midget Abraham Lincoln. Going into the loo! Get all the kids before Krusty okay. leaves. Okay, how... 15 kids. In 1 minute 45, in this slow school bus. Right. Back in this part of town. So, here we go. Oh, how bad could it be? How bad could it be after the other missions we've, we've, we've done today? Uh, honestly, I don't want to know, but we're here to do it. Yes, we are. At least one more, one more mission today, because uh, obviously a lot of gaps in my, in my filming thing from having to redo things over and over and over. Oh, I knew I was going to hit that. I knew I was going to hit that. Ah, that is the worst. Give, no. I can't get back in the car. Really? Oh, not again! That is hot garbage. Okay. Why is there a kid on the ramp? Is my question. That seems like a bad idea to be standing on a ramp like that, but what do I know? Okay, nine. Let's just not get a hit and run here. On this, it's gonna be real hard to not get a hit and run here. Because we're in this giant bus. All these people on this. Get out of the way! Oh my, I don't wanna get a hit and run. I want to be able to make it through this nonsense. 12. Okay. Straight shot. 13. 14. And 15. Get to Krusty Lou Studios uh, in the next 30 seconds. Please, oh please, don't be a bit of distance from where I'm currently at. Like, honestly, I don't recall where it is. I feel like we're right here. I see all the lights. That should be right. That should be good. Oh, that was gnarly, oh, man. Oh, yeah. I totally rule. Okay, I've been sitting here for 40 minutes now, which means that my time today is up. I'll see you next time on The Simpsons Sit and Run. Thanks for watching. I'm Attack Slug, and I'm out.